it seemed like you guys were the better team for a lot of that game. It just seemed like every mistake went in the net. Uh, other than that, you guys seemed to have a lot of good chances and, and carried a lot of the play, didn't you? Uh, yeah, I think uh, tonight we had a lot more conviction than we've had in past games this year. And um, you know what? Some tough bounces. Puck goes in our net. Like, like maybe like one of them back. I thought Eric played really well. It's, it's not easy for a goalie to, to not see a lot of shots. And then at times he was seeing two and three at a time. So I thought he played really well. I mean, obviously it's, uh, it's tough to win games with only two goals as well, I think, in this league. It's becoming more offensive. So we got to find ways to score. I thought Hellebuck played really well. But I thought we carried most of the pace, most of the tempo out there. Um, it was good to see. I think we did a little bit late, though. I think we still can start a little bit more on time. Is that something you can carry forward for the rest of the trip, the, the connection you talked about? Yeah, it's momentum. I mean, it's a, it's a standard that we have to keep ourselves to, and we can't wait for it to happen or wait to get down a goal, wait to get fired up by the coach or our captain or whoever's talking on the bench. So uh, we have to go out there and, and find it within ourselves. And you know what? You guys have to elevate. If you're not going to elevate this early in the season, why do it at all? So, you know, we got a really good team in here. we got a team that cares about each other a lot. Thought we showed it tonight. Uh, we're going to have to continue because it's not always going to go our way. We're going to take a lot of the good things, and uh, we're also going to remember the bad. So, did you defensively though? You had that in your game right away, didn't you? I mean, it seemed like from start to finish, you guys pretty much eliminated chances. It was just the offense that maybe took a while to kick in. Yeah, no, I thought. Uh, I mean, it was a low, low shot first period. I think seven to six, and then. Second period, I thought we got a little bit more offense going, but we, I thought we kept it with it, uh, with it for the defensive side of things. I think we, like you said, limited their chances and uh, played well. And when we needed uh, Ricky to make a save, he made it for the most part, and that's what happens. I mean, I feel bad. Matt, that one, it's a really unlucky goal, and uh, you know, I wish we could have just helped him out a little bit more. And um, but it, I thought it was a really strong outing for him coming back off injury too. So especially against your old team, it's never easy to to play against your old team and. I played well. You know what that dynamic's going to be here without Tage for a good long while. But is it shocking almost four goals in three games for this team? I mean, with the amount of guys in here who can score. Yeah, I mean, you could look at it just the last couple of games and maybe the couple of games before that, we had a lot more. So, I mean, I, I think that our offense can be a little bit obviously better. Uh, I, I don't think we're near where we were last year, but our defense is, I thought, taking a step forward. So we have to continue to focus on defense, continue because I think defense wins games, and defense will take us a lot further if we continue to bear down and, and be better and continue to be better. And uh, offense will come. We have a lot of skill in this room. Is your goal maybe the perfect example of what you guys need to do? All three you were right there. You caused two turnovers, and then you wind up scoring a goal. Is that exactly what you guys need to do? I think being one of the youngest and probably fastest team in the league, that's what we're going to do. Is not we're not going to go out there and bully a team. We're not going to go out there and throw a bunch of massive hits, but. We're going to pick, po pick pucks off. We're going to pick passes off. We're going to get to the net. We're going to stick lift and try to outwork the opponent. And I think, like you said, that, that was a good play all around on the four check. And uh, that led to the goal. I thought we had a lot of shifts like that. And a couple posts and a couple of really big saves by Hellebach, a couple of big blocks by their defensemen. And we got to continue to just, you know what, sometimes it's not going our way. Simplify, find your confidence any way you can away from scoring goals. And I think that's a really big key individually and then to help the team. Casey Middlestaff is really obviously last year's his big breakout year, but this year it seems like he's even hit another gear. Like, what have you noticed from him this year that's made such an important player for you guys? Oh, I mean, uh, he, he's got the puck on a string out there. It's uh, it's awesome to see his confidence is continuing to grow, and he's continuing to understand how well he can protect the puck and how, yeah. how like you know, honestly, like his skating was so, his his knack during that injured time and stuff, and he's he's shown he's got a lot of speed and he's got that set, uh, that next level of speed that helps his game, but. I mean, the, what, the things that he can see and the things that he can do with the puck is like no one I've ever played with and seen before, and he's going to continue to elevate, and he doesn't even know how good he is, I don't think. And uh, So we're going to need him to be big, especially down the stretch, missing a guy like Tage.